Hello everybody, this is Paul from Ortho Valpal. Today I'm going to talk to you about identifying an L4 nerve root compression. Okay, so what are some of the common signs? Patient comes in and they say, you know, I'm getting a lot of pain that goes on to the inside of my knee. And this gets mistaken for pezantrine bursitis, medial knee pain, meniscus tears, um, and adductor strains, and all that type of thing. So um, it's very common to get discomfort anterior thigh that drives to the medial knee. That's L4. Okay. As far as reflexes go, um, the patella reflex is L4, as you can see. It's a little hyper reflexive also. Um, and then as far as strength goes. <laughs> Quads are L3, L4, so I'm going to have you hold there. Don't let me push down. Good, and I would check the other side to compare. I also like to assess dorsiflexion. Hold there. Don't let me push it down. And I put quite a bit of force there. Um, if you wanted to, you can have the patient uh, do some heel walking, and if they foot slap, you need to be suspicious of an L4, L5 um, lesion. So the other thing that could be positive and is often positive with an L4 is a straight leg raise test. So I'm going to have you come right back down back. I have them keep the other leg straight. I hold this leg straight and I start lifting it. Now typically if somebody has a nerve root compression, usually from a herniated disc, a large herniated disc, because there's a lot of inflammation around that nerve, they're going to start getting cranky around 35, 40 degrees here. And if they say, you know what, I've got pain going down my leg, um, it's typically going to be giving them discomfort on the, on the medial side. Sometimes they'll get a little bit of tibial discomfort. Then you back off and they say, ah, oh, that feels great. And then you do a less seg sign. You take the foot, you dorsiflex it, that puts a little more neural tension. And if they say, I feel stretching in my calf, ah, no big deal. But if they say, you know, it's reproducing that pain that I had when my leg was higher and, and the pain is a little more... Um, superior to the knee, then you need to be concerned with some nerve root compression. You get them uncomfortable here, you flex the knee, and they say, oh, that feels great. Then you just check to make sure they don't have a sign of the buttock, and uh, we'll be talking about that soon, too. So, um, weakness of dorsiflexion, quads, pain on the medial side of the knee, loss of patellar reflex, L4 nerve root compression.